Okay, so this is part three of building rock, paper, scissors against a computer player in Java. Um, so go back and check out part one and part two if you want to kind of catch up with where we are. Um, where we left off was we were trying to build this print results method, um, which kind of tells you what you chose and what the computer chose. And then based on what those choices were, you either won, lost, or tied. Okay, so a lot of this logic kind of looks pretty bulky, but there's not a whole lot of different ways around it, in my opinion. Um, it's readable, right? If you chose rock, this is what happens. If, you, if the computer chose rock, you tied. If the computer chose paper, you lost. If the computer chose scissors, you win. Okay, so the logic for inside the paper and scissors choices blocks are pretty much exactly the same, but you just kind of change around the order of when wins and losses happen. So let's just borrow that and dump it in here and then change it accordingly. Okay, so let's say we, as the user, chose paper. If the computer chose rock, then we won. Okay. Um, if we chose paper and the computer chose paper, we tied. All right. So remember, this whole block is if we chose paper. Um, if the computer chose scissors, we lost. All right. So if we chose scissors and the computer chose rock, then we lost. If we chose scissors and the computer chose paper, we won. If we both chose scissors, then we tied. Okay. So pretty easy, right? And then. After the results are printed for the game, let's do just like a little bit of a, like a little styling um, sort of, you know, just a line that goes across that, you know, separates the games a little bit. Okay. So I'm pretty sure after all that code without running anything, there's going to be a bug. So let's run it. And you, you know, a lot of you guys actually catch these as you're watching it and it drives you crazy and I'm sorry. <laughs> so Let's see if we can find it. Maybe there's not a bug. Maybe we got lucky here. Okay, let's go ahead and run this. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to cut whatever. Let's ditch everything. Did I run it? Did I already run it? Oh, this is from before. Okay, like clear my, you know, I tested this schema and it worked, but let me make sure. How many games do you like to play? How about five games? Cool. So far it's working. Choose rock, paper, or scissors. I'm going to choose paper. Okay, I chose paper, computer chose scissors. I lost, okay, so one game has been completed. Uh, should I choose this time, rock? I won that time, I chose rock, the computer chose scissors, that's great. So this looks like it's going well. Let's choose scissors. So I choose scissors, okay, I lost. So, so far three games have been completed. I chose, I won, so that's four games completed. I lost, okay, good, so that worked. All right, so thanks for playing rock, paper, scissors. Look at that, just it's a magic touch on the game, right? It makes it all worth it. Um, so this works pretty well. You know what I'd like to do is run it again. You can see that there were no ties. So I'd like to see if I, you know, if that worked with the whole like, the ties not counting as a game. So let's see if we can play like three games, okay? Let's look for a tie. Okay, good. So, so far there should be no games completed. Um, yeah, I lost that one. I tied that one. Only one game has still been completed. I lost that one. There should be one more game to go. I tied. There should be another game. There we go, finally. Okay, so this is working where ties don't count as games. So this, this is what I hoped for. Okay, so it looks pretty good. You know, formatting-wise, not horrible, right? There's kind of a little bit of a space issue right there, um, but really not that bad. You know, I think I'm just going to leave it. So let's kind of add some improvements to our game. Okay. Um, first of all, let's, you know, let's fix that little space. Okay. So what, in what way can we improve this game? Okay. I'm looking up in the corner here. It says, okay, so there's some audio problems on this video. If there are some audio problems, I'm sorry. If it's bad enough, I'll remake it. Okay, so um, I'm going to kind of call this good for this video. I'm a little bit concerned that the audio quality looks like it says it's, you know, losing frames. So I'm going to figure that out in a second here. But let's go ahead and call it good for this video, and then we'll improve this. Maybe we'll make a two-player game, okay? And that's not going to be all that much harder, okay? So let's go ahead and cut the video here, and let's do two-player and maybe some other extensions in the next video. All right, you guys, I'll talk to you guys soon.